disappear from the radar. Liz? Hmm. Interesting. Well, caught on camera, this very scary moment. <laughs> Rescuers uh, caught a skier slipping off a chairlift. Oh, that is just so hard to watch. That is in uh, upstate New York. The skier can be seen, as you can see, dangling by her jacket. This happened at the Bristol Mountain Ski Resort yesterday. The resort ski patrol was able to get to her quickly. The skier slowly slipped out of her jacket and then fell into a safety tarp stretched out below. Oh, thank goodness I didn't the FAA said there were no aircraft incidents or accidents in the area at the Sunday, in the course of taping, James found the answer to his own question. They 
sure as I can, you know. Um, and the more comfortable I got with that, the more comfortable I got with uh, letting my walls down. You know, I can't please everybody. Trying to find love on TV in front of millions of people is never easy. And COVID restrictions and the degree of difficulty increases. Good man, so get it straight. To be honest with you, there weren't a lot of challenges for us because uh, we were in a bubble, you know, no one in, no one out, and we're being tested constantly, so it's the same stuff, you know. And James is a rookie, the first bachelor in a dozen years who has never appeared on any other shows in the franchise. Well, Mike Tyson said it best, you know, everyone's got a plan until they get front to the middle. And, um, and that first night, that's how I felt. The season was filmed at a resort in Pennsylvania, about six hours drive from his home in the city. He started a local charity here to benefit kids, but he does not shy away from addressing injustice. Because... That's who I am. You know, I'm a black man, and when I see something that's going on in my community, and I have a voice, uh, I want to be part of that change, and I want to be on the right side of history. Matt James co-founded a non-profit called ABC Food Tours that takes groups of kids from elementary school to their communities, communities often underserved. It's designed to help kids eat healthy.